Outside of eye drop problems, which I never had when I used to use one, and being dumpstered in Reversi, a board game that I've only heard of just now, we pretty much have two talking points today. The first is the open fly from Raido. And I don't know about Japan, but at least here in my country, if any one of us had an open fly, someone would point it out right away, regardless of whether the person who spotted it is male or female. So for it to go an entire day unnoticed, except for a Haren san, I mean, he even went to the comfort room and still managed to not realize it. And that's when you know it's suspicious. Like, I got the joke, don't get me wrong, but really, it feels forced, not gonna lie. Anyway, the more concerning part of this whole skit is actually what Raido is wearing, and really, it's one thing to wear boxer shorts, but to wear something so contrasting with your pants. Well, if anything, I'm starting to doubt his wardrobe choices at this point. As for the other talking point, it's Oshiro-san. I mean, who else could it be? She's the main highlight of today's episode, so guys and girls, what's your take on Oshiro? I initially mistook her for Reina Ueda because some of her lines kind of sounded like how Ganyu speaks, just a higher on the pitch but it turns out Oshiro had a different VA. Other than that, I don't know what else to say about her. I mean, for an impressively tall girl, she's actually quite fragile and even more so than Aharin herself. And I can definitely see the author doing a bunch of skits around this fragility of hers but if you're going to ask me, Hopefully, she gets some considerable character development in the long run because it would be a shame if she and Raido never got to talk with each other normally by the end of this season. And with that said, that's basically it for this episode. I thank you all for watching and see you guys next week.